craving for a delightful escape. Picture this, pristine white sand beaches, lush green mountains, bustling cities steeped in history. Welcome to Top Dog Traveler and our visit to the Philippines, an archipelago filled with diverse and captivating destinations. Today we embark on an adventure to the top 10 must visit places in this tropical paradise. At number 10, step into the tranquil charm of Batanes's remote islands. Our journey takes us across its rolling hills, past dramatic seascapes, and through villages dotted with unique stone houses. These houses, built to fierce typhoons, echo the resilience of Ivatan, the indigenous people of Batanes. The Ivatan's rich culture, deeply rooted in fishing and farming traditions, is as captivating as the immaculate landscapes. Traditional Ivatan houses, also known as Vatui, are a marvel of indigenous engineering. Made of lime and stones, Vatui form an intrinsic part of the island's heritage, which speaks volumes about the Ivatan's resourcefulness and close bond with nature. While in Batanes, indulge in authentic Ivatan cuisine, taste the Uvud balls, a local delicacy made from banana pith and minced fish. For the best experience, plan your visit during the dry season from March to June, when the islands shine with serene beauty. Securing the ninth spot is Dumaguete, affectionately known as the City of Gentle People. This treasure trove is a sanctuary for divers and nature lovers. The most preferable time to visit is during the dry season from November to May. Dumaguete is also celebrated for its delectable local cuisine. Food enthusiasts can indulge in a variety of delicacies from the rich Bud Bud Kabog to the savory Dumaguete Express. Dumaguete's festive spirit is encapsulated in the vibrant Sandoro Festival, a local tradition showcasing the city's rich history and warm, welcoming culture. Eighth on our list, we journey back in time with Vegan, a mesmerizing testament to history. Marvel at the well-preserved Spanish architecture of this UNESCO World Heritage Site. These historical structures, dating back to the colonial era, provide a unique glimpse into the fusion of cultures, a delicate blend of Asian building design and construction with European colonial architecture and planning. They stand as enduring symbols of the Spanish regime's significant influence on the Philippines, shaping not only the country's architecture but also its culture. The dry season from November to April is the ideal time to explore comfortably, allowing ample opportunity to delve into the rich history that Vegan has to offer. Positioned at number seven on our list is Davao. Famed for its exotic bounty, including the King of Fruits, the Durian, and an array of other tropical delights. This city also stands as proud home to the majestic Mount Apo. Enriched with a sweeping variety of flora and fauna, Davao hosts a thriving wildlife, including the rare Philippine eagle and the Samal bat. It's also a botanical treasure trove, with the wailing wailing orchid and the pitcher plant being standout features. Offering a unique blend of nature and culture, the city truly comes alive in the dry season from November to May, the optimal time to immerse yourself in Davao's vibrant biodiversity. Our journey continues to number six, the Banaue Rice Terraces. Here you don't just witness the grandeur of the terraces, but you also submerge yourself in the intricate cultural heritage. These terraces carved meticulously into the mountains over 2000 years ago are not just a spectacle to behold, but a testament to the community's resilience and ingenuity. The local Ifugao people follow an age-old system of rice cultivation using traditional hand tools and intricate irrigation systems. The process is a unique blend of community effort and time-honored practice passed down from generation to generation. The cool, dry season between November and April offers the most favorable conditions for your visit, coinciding with the planting and harvest seasons, giving you the opportunity to witness these ancient practices in action. We find ourselves in the midst of the bustling city life of Manila as we hit the halfway mark at number five. Manila, although not your classic beach getaway, is a treasure trove of historical landmarks and a cradle of vibrant culture. The city's nightlife is a kaleidoscope of experiences, from pulsating clubs and serene jazz bars to open-air concerts. Foodies will be in paradise here, as the city's culinary scene offers a blend of local, Asian and Spanish flavors in street food corners, casual dining spots and upscale restaurants. Manila is an all-season destination, but do be mindful of the occasional typhoons during the wet season from June to November. Moving on to number four, we voyage to the exotic Cebu. Unfold the marvels of Oslob and Molbol, 
Oslob is globally recognized for its whale shark watching opportunity, where you can witness the majestic dance of gentle giants. Meanwhile, Moelbol presents a vibrant underwater spectacle of incredibly colorful coral reefs, teeming with marine life. Here you can immerse yourself in an underwater paradise, spotting unique species like the vibrant sardines, elusive thresher sharks, charming clownfish, the rare and beautiful mandarin fish. The dry season, stretching from December to May, is the ideal time for these underwater escapades, promising clear waters and a plethora of marine life sightings. Third on our list, we immerse ourselves in the vibrant surf culture of Siagao, known as the surfing capital of the Philippines. In this island paradise, surfing is not just a sport, it's a way of life. From sunrise to sunset, you'll find locals and tourists alike conquering the waves. For those truly seeking the best surfing conditions, plan a visit during the high season from September to November. But Siagao's love affair with surfing doesn't end there. Throughout the year, the local community hosts numerous surf competitions, attracting international surfers and spectators. So come experience the passion and thrill that makes Siagao a surfer's paradise. Our runner-up is Palawan, particularly the awe-inspiring locales of El Nido and Coron. El Nido is home to magnificent limestone cliffs that tower overhead and hidden lagoons, each with its unique micro-ecosystem. These secret havens host a rich biodiversity, including a variety of tropical fish and coral species. Coron, on the other hand, is a marine sanctuary teeming with life. The waters around Coron are vibrant with an array of marine species, from colorful coral gardens to schools of jackfish and barracuda. Moreover, it's the final resting place for a number of historical shipwrecks, each forming artificial reefs that nurture the marine ecosystem. The dry season from November to May is the perfect time for exploration, as the waters are calm and clear, offering the best views of these natural wonders. Finally, we reach the pinnacle of our list at number one, the globally acclaimed island of Boracay. This tropical haven is celebrated for its velvety white sand beaches and sparkling clear waters, making it an absolute paradise for beach enthusiasts. Also hosts an array of vibrant local festivals and events throughout the year. The Ati Ati Han Festival, a week-long celebration in January, is an explosion of color and music that honors the ATI people, the island's first inhabitants. Another significant event is the Labrake Weekend, typically falling in April or May, which attracts party-goers with pulsating electronic dance music and fire dancing performances. The dry season from November to April is considered the prime time to visit to fully experience the island's spectacles and bask in its natural beauty. So there you have it, the top 10 must-visit places in the Philippines, each one offering a unique experience, a slice of paradise waiting to be discovered. If you enjoyed this immersive voyage through the Philippines and are itching for more travel inspiration, don't forget to hit that like button. It's a big world out there and we're just getting started. Make sure to subscribe and turn on notifications for Top Dog Traveler to stay updated and informed. We've got plenty of wanderlust inducing content coming your way. As we wrap up our immersive journey through the Philippines, we want to leave you with a final local sentiment, Hangang Samuli, which translates to until next time in Filipino. This is not just a farewell, but a promise to meet again, to explore more of the beautiful Philippines together. So here's to the next time we embark on another adventure, uncovering the hidden gems and untold stories of our fascinating world. Until then, keep dreaming, keep exploring, and remember every journey begins with a single step. Hangang Samuli, fellow top dog travelers.